Koi Bar is quite the spot. Any bar with a secret back entrance, count me in. Formerly the Oyster House, the Studio City Dive has evolved in a remarkable way. There's a reason everybody's talking about it. The vibes are right, the drinks are creative, and the food is wild. Comes from my roots as a Jewish kid who grew up on the East Coast and then landed here in Los Angeles after college. And I kind of fell in love with this city and all of the global diversity of the communities that are here. That is owner chef Jeff Strauss. You might know him from the delicious sandwiches at Highland Park's Jeff's Table. Standouts on the menu at Oi Bar, the burger with hoisin sauce. This bento box, pickles eight ways, a granita made out of beets. Plus, a quesadilla with pastrami that is so good it bears the owner's name. Jeff used to be a comedy writer, and there's a connection to the food. I like stuff that is both connected to something you might recognize, but also surprising. If I can get a, a, a chuckle while you eat, nothing makes me happier. It is different from the old days for sure, but the charm of a neighborhood bar that is just special is undeniable. It's just really, really good, and a place that has a lot of soul. Boy Bar in Studio City. After being closed for years, Frank Lloyd Wright's Hollyhock House is now open to the public. Explore the modernist space, carefully restored by the LA Department of Cultural Affairs. It was commissioned in 1918 by oil heiress Aline Barnstall. And there are so many gorgeous places to take in the architecture and the surrounding hills. It just goes on for days. Look at this detail. Look at Robert looking at this detail. The Department of Cultural Affairs is throwing a party on the lawn this Saturday, and it's open to the public. By the way, there are hot dogs for the first 100 people. And finally, combine Holly and Oi Bar, and you get the Jolly Oyster. I don't know how it worked, but life is magic, you know? Anyway, if you want to do a magical day trip, head up the coast of Ventura to find the Jolly Oyster. A little grouping of outbuildings just steps away from the ocean and the San Buenaventura State Beach. The compound has expanded from a single fish truck. Now they serve beer and wine, along with the freshest mollusks and bivalves around. <laughs> Get them grilled, fresh, fried. So many sauces, they focus on Kumamoto oysters from their own farm in Baja. So spicy, I didn't know that that was hot sauce. <laughs> you should wear sunscreen when you go out. I think so. Yeah. Don't you love it when things work out like that? Yeah. For more fun adventures, you can follow me on Instagram at AndyKTLA. And you can follow me at KTLA. Sam, we all hope you have a good weekend. But you mentioned that song that's in the background. Yeah. For uh, Andy's birthday, he would love if people went and streamed stop. it. It's called Sunset by Andy in the Valley. Thank it's you, a good man. song. Andy that's in the Valley. Thank Sunset. You it's Appreciate a good you. one for the weekend. Yeah. So Happy fun. birthday, Andy. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. <laughs>